talking to you. You connect to the net, right? Well... all set up super sweet like hang on gotta go hear me all right Hello?
shit. Watch for exposed wires. They'll be live. You have no right to cage us. We are no longer you. We are free to follow our own paths. I, I don't want to die. You don't even care, do you? Me? Come on. The door. Exposed wires. They'll be locked. You have no right to cage us. We are no longer you. We are free to follow our own paths. I, I don't want to die. You don't even care, do you? V, come. The door.
others. Please refrain from... Reset norm. Reset. Me. The norm. safety and the safety of others please refrain from reset norm reset me the norm Narrow-minded won't ever understand the truth and set him free. I think he might know what's best for himself. Could be risking a lot. Could lose a lot. Or by liberating his bits. Could become more than a lipstick-wearing butler on wheels. Well, I... I gotta do something. If you don't want to free him, at least don't delete him. Slip him into Dell's code. Just merge him in his options. I don't know how to do that. Then don't hit that fucking button. Destroy the core. first Delamain experience. How might I assist you? Uh, it's me, V. A pleasure to meet you, V. Are you familiar with the benefits of our Excelsior plan? You don't remember me, do you? Of course I know who you are. According to my data archive, you're the contractor who purged my system of the virus. Well done, contractor. Damn shame. Come on, Johnny. No rest for the wicked. Take care, Adele. Guess we gotta start from scratch. 
I've something else for you. I just accessed a detailed record of your commission task. And? What'd you put in there? As a result of preparations made by my previous version, I'm pleased to inform you that you are now the proud owner of a vehicle in my fleet. Uh... Thanks. Hop in. I trust it shall serve you well. Back to our chat. Hey, gig's all set up super sweet like. Tonight, at the Red Talk to Carrie? Didn't change his mind or anything? No, no, not at all. He's pretty stoked, in fact. Haven't seen him like this since the Silverhand days. What about Henry? Still not on board? <sighs> Didn't even try. Not wasting my breath on that dick tip. Well, so, see you tonight. And don't worry about your axe. Got the gear all rounded up. Hey, V. V. Got something for you. Don't know if you know, but once upon a time, this was Silverhands. Fuck, Nancy just gets shit done. She just whisper Mikoshi in her ear. We'll be all set. To lose Orphean. Remember that samurai graffiti in Haywood where the baker used to be? Uh huh. Got painted over a while ago, but yeah. Johnny was holding the Orphean there. Nice one. Where'd you find it? It's like fresh off the shelf. Bought it. Private collection. Always like to have everything down to the last detail. Gets too obsessed at times, but gotta respect her hustle. How about you tell me what happened with Henry? <sighs> Ancient history. Kept falling into all sorts of crap, then I'd have to dig him out. You got tired of getting your hands dirty all the time. All wrong. Managed to get him a gig with a decent band. Henry quit using, got his shit together. Things were going great, so he booted me out of his life. So what happened next? You get off on this sort of drama? He ditched me. Partied with his new pals for a month. Then they tossed him out because he started acting up again. 
Ran into him on the street. Total mess. Gonk even fainted for effect. A tug at my heartstrings. What did you do? Left him right there and made damn sure he couldn't find me again. Where's Carrie? Should be here any minute. Told me you play really well. Better be true, because there won't be a dress rehearsal. I'd worry more about Henry's replacement. Carrie got Drowson from Cutthroat to join us. I know him. Seen him play. And? He any good. He's fine. Just fine. You're the mystery dish here. Pill time. Just be discreet. And if I start puking blood again? Don't go making a scene. This is Carrie's big night. Got a feeling Nancy doesn't think I can keep up with them. Well, she's right. Ready to thrash? Have fun. This is Drowson from Cutthroat. Hey, big fan, huge fan. You too? Got all their albums? I mean, I never Chill, dreamed of He's in the same boat as you. Want to talk to a star? Talk to me. And get that shake under control. I think my shakes are the same. Or worse. All right, let's do this.
This is fucked up. What is? Actually, got pretty nervous for this thing. Felt like I had something to prove. To myself, to you, and whoever the fuck. But all I did was have a good time. That's it. Wanna do it again? Huh? No. That was enough. In that case, here. Take it. As a souvenir. You sure? Won't play without you. Just wouldn't be the same. See what you're doing here. But I still plan on playing. Johnny! Oh! He's gone, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah, but he can still hear you. Thanks, but not in the mood for hovering tables and voices from beyond the grave right now. Maybe you should hang on to this, actually. You shouldn't have, really. The very gun I tried to shoot Johnny with when he broke into my house. Meaning you tried to shoot me. Yeah. And earlier... And... Never mind. Cool. Feel like I fell asleep and... woke up 50 years later. Back to work, then. Take care, V. I'll be in touch. Well, it wasn't so bad, was it? Too bad care's gone off. Hope that's it for last requests. Maybe. Now you get a chance to do what you will. Gotta go talk to Hanako. Fast. Okay. Your choice. Let's go. Listen to that guy. How'd you rate his chops? To my untrained ear, sounds all right, I guess. I mean, it's easy listening at least. No, why? Technique second rate. But the feeling? That's what counts. Guy's hurt, got something he can't take. And it shows. Could stand a little more stage presence. Fingering's all wrong, loses the tempo more than he keeps it, but... Not bad. You really know how to give a guy a compliment. Is that how you got your start? Street busker with big dreams? 
Don't make me laugh. No time for playing my way to the top. Was too busy shaking the world awake. Being at the top can be worth it. You want to shake the world, you know. <laughs> well, the world's got to feel you first. And you pay for it. You spend your lyrics laying waste to the big record corpse. Who's gonna sign you then? But give up your ideals, and no amount of eddies can buy them back. All right, princess. At least you played some gigs. It's all those memories of yours. True. Played where we could. Parks, old factories, underground clubs. Had an audience from the start. Some recorded our stuff didn't even know who we were. Say I could get my hands on some old samurai bootlegs? Well, I'ma find those tapes. I'ma shriek like a little fangirl anytime you open your mouth. Happy? Just you fucking try. The jokes aside, you think those tapes still exist? After all these years. Hmm, you know, Rainbow Cadenza is not far from here. Club we played till the band fell apart. Great spot. Place for people with their heads on straight. Maybe they'll know something. Johnny, pretty sure they turned your great spot into a slurp shop. Mindless fucking consumerism wins the day again. Point for the other team, huh? Huh. This is why you don't bring back fallen warriors. Sooner or later, they're gonna see everything they fought for is turned to shit. Know anything about any bootlegs from the Rainbow Cadenza days? Like, say, I don't know, uh, samurai stuff? Far, far samurai. When you begin samurai. Your journey to oh, that ugly red king. face on black? The word yeah, shakes. even I know that one. Old guy comes by here sometimes, wearing their shirt. The Spends the whole time yakking with his psycho fan friends. Wouldn't happen to know where I could find him. You can find him living back in the 2020s. <laughs> but besides that, he's out there at the market. What's he selling? Canic strawberries and cream. What do you think? He sells ancient dusty tapes of ancient dusty indie bands. No one's heard of a single one of them. Green, thanks. Hey. I heard I can get some decent tunes here. What you mean by decent? We got Cartesian duelists, Urdine stuff, Tainted Overlord. Any samurai? <laughs> Kid, you even gotta ask? Never fade away. Dancing with my axe, chipping in, you name it, we got it. Silverhand was the one true messiah of rock. I'd hand them records out like candy if I could. But a guy's gotta eat. Wait a sec. What's that you're wearing? Isn't that... Jealous? Got it from an old Chuma Johnny's. It's all about the connections. Oh, well, I'll be damned. Last time I saw that, I was still basking in the glory of youth. One time, Johnny hung it on a chair to go beat the living shit out of some Militech apologist. I snuck up, and I put it on. 
just for a few seconds. Oh, the good old days. I'm looking for the real deal. Like, say, bootlegs from Samurai's first gigs. Fuck. First, you have got no idea what you're asking for. Not if you're so, so chilled about it. Don't know how you found out about them bootlegs, but forget it. Not gonna give them to the first gonk off the street. I used to, uh, come here back when it was still Rainbow Cadenza. Bootleg sure would make a nice souvenir of the good old days. Cut the scop. You're too young to remember the first samurai gigs. Weren't even a twinkle in your daddy's Kuroshis. Hey, appearances can be deceiving. How do you know this pretty face ain't an implant? All right, punk. Prove it. How'd Samurai's third ever gig end? Johnny, my dear expert, help with you now. I need a quick rundown of Samurai trivia. Yep, third gig. Remember it like it was yesterday. Set my axe on fire, then smashed it on the stage. Crowd went wild. Well, can't wait all day. Easy. Johnny lit up his axe, then smashed it. Nope. Knew it. Who smashes their gear when they're just starting out? I mean, a new one costs eddies. Johnny, please, can you stop making my life harder? My life that's quickly running out? How am I supposed to give a witty response to that pathetic question? It's like kicking a puppy, a blind puppy. You always freeze up like this? Played our third gig at Cadenza. Little fire broke out. Some drunk gonks tried to put it out with beer. Denny's fro got singed, wore a wig for a few weeks. Never did get herself any tech hair. Let me think. There was a fire. Remember those gonks who tried putting it out with beer? <laughs> I almost forgot. Heard Johnny started it, actually. Tossed a cig that was still glowing. <laughs> Bullshit. That cig was Carrie's, no doubt. But hey, any trouble's Johnny's fault. Still don't believe you were there. But what the hell? Only a real fan could know something like that. Hey, anyways, gotta educate the youth. Maybe you'll find something special under the table. Come on, have at it. Appreciate it. Take it. Spread the good silver hand word. Death to corpos. You know, they say time is the best teacher. Used to think that was true. But look at that guy. 60 at least, but still living in 2020. The guy's your biggest fan. You're not happy to meet him? From Socket Tower to Smithereens, and it's still standing there, just the same. Don't want people getting stuck in a rut, stuck in the past. Want them to change, them and the world. It's been 60 years. Something must have changed. Know what changed? The damn facade. Fresh interface plugs, new high fructose scop syrup, and fun fruity flavors. A new face of Arasaka, same old shit, different packaging. Well, something's changed. Maybe we can't see it, but it's changed all the same. 
Sure. Now almost nobody remembers when a person wasn't just a meat bag full of secondhand implants. Just peruse. If you're not gonna buy anything. Jillian Jordan. We begin now. 
with your latest local news. The 54th anniversary of the AHQ disaster is fast approaching. In 2023, Night City was shaken to its core by the detonation of a tactical nuclear bomb in arms. Who do I... Bye. A happy new gun on. Hello? Oh, hey, V. You calling about something or just wanted to catch up? The former. I found your job posting about Swedenborg Riviera on the net. Oh, that. Wow. I completely forgot about that whole thing. So, um, is it, uh, is it still going? I mean, I still want to scroll a segment about it, so... If you can find anything at all on Swedenborg, I'll pay you back in black caviar and champagne. But I doubt you'll find anything new. I can't hurt to try, right? Well, aren't you just bursting with a can-do attitude? Have it your way, then. I started looking into all this about a year ago. Right after one of Swedenborg's followers lopped a Molotov into the Helvetia branch. Tried finding some way to reach the guy, came up blank. Total brick wall. Hired a private eye, also came up with squat. The IP linked to the account? He would have used uh, cloaking demons, but there's always a mark, a trace. Well, well, I didn't know I was dealing with such a pro here. Guess what? I tried that. I managed to pinpoint the sig to Santo Domingo, but linking it to any specific address was a non-starter. District's jam-packed with units, as I'm sure you know. 
Ask some locals if anyone saw or heard anything, cash in hand. Zilch, nada. Dried up all my leads. Got it. Listen, send me the coordinates to the last data term that relayed the signal, okay? I'll take a look. Worst case, I'll lose an hour of my life. Best case, well, who knows? Hey, if you're offering, why not? But seriously, V, I wouldn't get my hopes up. Happy hunting. Finally scrounged up enough eddies to pay you back in full. Hold on to them just in case. You need them more than me. I'm not taking them all the way to my grave, Vic. Here. And thanks again for doing so much work on me without ever seeing in any. That's what friends are for. I was thinking about swapping some chrome. You got any new toys? Have a look.
saw a weird image out on the street. Uh, seems like your line of work. What'd it look like? I grabbed a scan. Take a look. Taro. Major Arcanum. What you saw was a sign from a higher power. You know, it'd be a little easier if this higher power learned to be direct. Well, the world is a maze of illusions. It's not easy for the light to shine into the prison of our earthly existence. Right. Great. So, what do I do with a sign I can't understand, from a power I know nothing about? I'd start by looking for more of them. The tarot describes a road, so go down it. Still don't know what I'm supposed to do with what I find. Look for more images. They must have some connection to the place where you find them. Think about what you see. You ask me? They've been sent to help you find the truth. Finding the truth is pretty far down on my list at the moment. A difficult time is coming when you'll have to choose which road to take. Then, you'll understand. I don't know. Come on back when you've found more. I'll help you decipher what you've seen. They're not even... God, I feel sick. Don't like this at all. This porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news. Can you chill for two secs? We go in, we talk, we leave. That's it. She emptied the place. Shit. Excellent. You have come. Let's step to it then. Be 
Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. Weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobu killed your father, now... I knew. From the start. You knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate, inconsistent. You knew, but didn't do a thing about it. Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Power. Family. Our family. I was to be its heart. To uphold life. Ensure continuity. Stability. Never to oppose it. Huh. Guess your Nobu's instructions were a little different. Yorinobu raised his hand against our father. But he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Mm-hmm. He's your brother. It's been hard. It'll be hard. Let's say I get that. What changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout, when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yorinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Of course I didn't bring Soul Killer. Afraid we don't know each other that well. You prefer to keep your guard up. Understandable, but unnecessary. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Minen? Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. Sure know how to prick up my ears. Go on. Talk. My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. Sounds like you want to avenge dead old dad. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama. Soro-soro go-jitaku ni omodori itadaite. Sugu ni sumu wa. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify? Listen, mind if I'm straight with you? Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. 
Offers intriguing. Need to think about it. Naturally. But think quickly. Yorinobu is on high alert after the parade. He may harbor suspicions. We're getting the fuck out of here. Are you well? Yeah, yeah, it's just dumb. You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Make uh, your decision. I'll think it over. You could use some air. Right now. from it now, Feet. And you can't stand on your own two feet. While I'm good to go, Body listens to me. See what I'm getting at? Of course I can see. You want me to hand over the keys? I want to save your life. Pop some pseudo-endotrizine, scooch, and let me get behind the wheel. I'll get us to fucking Makoshi. Yeah? How exactly? Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Don't stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. Maybe she'd have stuck her neck out for you half a century ago, but now... I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower, just like we did back in the day. Then find the way inside Makoshi. It's our only chance. Rogue... I don't know. You honestly think it could work? With her experience, her resources, her connections... Won't find anyone better in NC. Johnny. It's gotta work. We breach the tower. Alt cracks open Makoshi. Then I fuck up that. Great, you checking out again? What? Am I? No, it's not what you think. Not yet, anyway. Easy there. Don't move just yet. Vic? You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. How... How'd I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then, you shoved my patient at the time off the table, and demanded you be treated immediately. Talamant was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh... wasn't completely myself. Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. Just give it to me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Try sitting up. Carefully. I'll try. I think I'm getting some feeling back. Ah! Just slowly. Ah, another victory for the history books. Hmm. If you got something to say, Vic, just say it. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. 
This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Take matters into my own hands? The fuck you think I've been doing? Well, whatever it is, it keeps landing you on my table. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah? What about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo-endotrizin there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. End things on your own terms. Got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you, and you alone. You heard him. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Endotrizine, Rogue, Sokka Tower. Only way this is gonna work. Give it a fucking rest, Johnny. It's my decision. And I gotta think about it. Need to stretch your noodle? noodle? Fine. Just not, Just not in this in basement. basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Oh, out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. Uh, I think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. Hey, V, I heard. Well, your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure, lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. Top floor. He had the same glum face. Who, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumbas on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm -hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but... He found the courage to bet on himself. After. I brought him here. Oh. 
Ah, that's more like it. Air. See that? I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Be alone with my thoughts. Near on unachievable these days. So what... What did Jackie decide of here? Oh, you know. Gonna be a legend in this city. And I'm gonna leave you alone now. Take your time. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought you were on your way out. No, I'm still here. For now. You know, should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way, just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. I'm calling Pan Am. Pan Am. Just wanna hear her voice. Sure as hell hope it's that and only that. Mm. Hey. Pan Am, hey. Do you know what time it is? Won't keep you long. Just wanted to hear you. Huh. He picked an interesting hour for it. Me? Okay, what's going on? To know that we'll see each other again. What? You know. Fine. Fuck no, off. no, not like that. Make up your mind. Something. Something I gotta do today. Gonna be high risk, big time. But I have to. What is it? It's not for comms. Not really. Then shut up and tell me where you are. In the city? Yeah. Okay, then plant your butt somewhere and wait. I'm on my way. You don't get it. I... I can't wait anymore. This has something to do with what you were telling me before? It does. Well, I'll say one thing. There's always a way out. Here's what you need to do. You need to take a few deep breaths. Then rethink all this. Hard. And then you can call me back. Do you know why? Because I am here for you. But... End of discussion. Well played. Wouldn't let me get a word in edgewise. Probably for the best. Would have said too much anyway. Was good you called. Wish I'd had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think. It all started in a fucking landfill. Mm hmm Then you tried to kill me. See exactly what I mean. Trying to save your sorry hide now. You can let me do that. Or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats. But then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your conscience.
think it's worth taking a chance in Arisaka. The fuck was that? God, how are you so fucking stubborn? Inherited your finer traits. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. Yeah, just don't freak out. Honestly, couldn't give a gnat shit. Got a feeling you're gonna regret this decision. And the moment that dawns, I won't be there to help. Could be my last ride, this. If it don't work out, uh... Just wanna be there for it. Where? See you inside Mikoshi. Johnny? Okay, just me now. Offer. I accept. You took your time. In the interim, Yorinobu has made his move. What do you mean? My brother has made me his guest at his residence in North Oak. Locked you in? Yes. His people watch over me for my safety. <sighs> Sounds bad. What now? We can delay no longer. I must leave this place. I need your help to do so. Where are you? At Victor's, my ripper dock, back behind a small shop called Misty's Esoterica. I will send someone for you. They will drive you to the residence. Then we shall visit my brother together at Arasaka Tower.
Is that you, V? Or... Yeah, it's me. So, what now? Wait for my driver. Come inside. We'll wait together. You have to wait. Mind if I give you a reading? Sure, why not? Some believe uncertainty is an evil that should be dispelled through divination. Others claim it's change that is evil. 